Hey guys, welcome to the fifth video in my Python for Everybody series. So uh, today we're going to solve the exercise for chapter 6, which talked about strings. So let's get started with it. Uh, so in this exercise we have this uh, string where we have to extract the portion uh, only after the colon here. For that, uh, the exercise suggests that we use uh, the find method uh, and then string slicing to extract that portion. So, to be clear, this is the string and we need to extract this portion right here. Okay, so first thing is we need uh, to find the index of the colon character right here. So that is pretty easy because Python provides the function find which we can use to uh, right now. So we can do a s s s str dot find, and then we will give as an argument the uh, the character we want to find in the string. So I'm just going to give the the column here. Okay, first we can test this. I'm just going to print this real quick, so we can run this script. Okay, as you can see, this uh, gives us 18, which is uh, the index of the colon right here. Okay, that's good. Now, let's assign this index to the... Uh, I'm just going to call this call index. Okay. So now we want to use string slicing to get on the, this portion, okay? So this is how we do it. So again, string, and then we start to slice from colon index plus one. We want to do this plus one because uh, we just want to take only the part after the colon. So since the index of the colon is a call index, then we want to start from call index plus one. And then we were going to use this notation. Uh, and for the uh, right limit, we, we don't have to assign anything since we want to take all the portion until the end of the string. So we just leave it like this. Okay. And then we can just print this to make sure we have everything right. I'm just going to put this inside the print statement. Okay, let's run it. Okay, that seems to be uh, working fine, but we are not done yet because we need to convert the uh, extracted string into a floating point number. So I'm just going to call this num is equal to float. Uh, and we, this float function converts this into the float that we want. Okay, so we can uh, try to test, test this by printing the number and then printing uh, the type of the number. Okay, let's run this. Here, and here it is. We get the extracted portion that we wanted and it is of the type float. Okay. Okay, guys, so uh, the important part is here is for you to be able to go and uh, read the Python documentation and read about the uh, different functions and methods we can apply on strings. They are really, really uh, handy and you can do a lot of stuff with them, like the find function is, is, is a really good example. Um, this was, um, I think uh, this would be a sh really short video because this was the only uh, exercise in the chapter where you have to write some lines of code. I hope you found this uh, helpful. I'm going to continue in, with the next chapter, chapters in the next videos. So I really uh, hope you derive uh some <laughs> something from all these videos and i hope you keep on learning python don't forget to check out my other series on django and uh, i'll see you in the next one bye bye